Now it's happened to all of us. You have something really special planned for your vehicle or even just a general repair. Maybe you're on a time crunch. You jump on your vehicle, you start doing the work, and then the inevitability. You strip out a fastener. And now you're spending the rest of the day or the weekend trying to remove, retap, whatever the case may be. Now this is incredibly apparent when you work on a modern vehicle. This is a 2011 S4. There is no working room, hardly any working room in this engine bay. And you'll see over and over again, these are all Torx fasteners. Very easy to strip and very, very soft metal. So let me show you something that has helped me over and over again. Now, most of you are probably not aware of this product. Now, once again, no one is paying me to show this. I'm not getting free product. This has helped me and I love to share that experience because we're essentially a community. And if it helps me, I love to pass that along so it helps you guys. So this is very similar if you're familiar with aircraft mechanics, which I tend to follow their forums. And they use something very, very similar to this. The whole point behind this product is that it increases the grip strength between the tool and the fastener so it doesn't strip. And apparently, according to this, it's up to 700%. Now the first thing you want to do is shake it up, especially if it's been sitting for some time in a cold garage. Well, let's say, for example, you need to remove a fastener such as this one. Look at the working room. There's essentially none. You cannot get this wrong. Now you can apply this to the fastener or the tool. In this case, I like to, if I can, apply it to the fastener, you do not need a lot, okay? Super, super small amount. I'm coming for a close-up, that's plenty. Now you may be thinking, ah, that's just Loctite, but it really isn't, check this out. It's almost like pumice, in a sense. That's what it feels like, but it, uh, it really does the job. And now, I have really excellent grip, and this makes all the difference. It really does. Now it goes without saying, also make sure before you attempt to remove any fastener, just clean it out. Use brake clean, compressed air, just make sure you get all of the crud out of the fastener. So I think most of you get the point. Just a small drop on the fastener, on the head of the fastener, or the tool that you'll be using. There's no need to let it dry, just crank away and you'll be in good shape. I would love to hear back if you have used this product or something similar. If you're looking for aircraft grade, I believe the product is called Easy Grip, but you're paying two and a half times more. It's probably more product too, but it's two and a half times more. This I purchased from Amazon. The local parts store just didn't have it. I'll have a link for it in the description box below. Yeah, uh, so big help, big plus. Hope it helps a number of you out there, and thanks for watching.